welcome back to my channel guys today I am showing you prototype Abby by Claire Teller um, painted by me so she was sculpted by Claire Teller she is a vinyl kit she has full arms full legs mm -hmm. and she also has a half tummy plate which I will show you in a little bit and um, she takes 20 millimeter eyes um, and she's about 19 inches long so she's a newborn, she's a very newborn baby. Um, and so she has, as you can see, she has open hands and she has um, some open toes and some, you know, together, but her big toe is separate on both feet. So therefore, summertime, she'll be able to wear her little jellies or little, you know, sandals that go between the toe. Anyway. So just so you guys know, I know I've been saying for a while, it's coming, it's coming, it's coming. Well, it's here. The time is almost here, pretty much here. Um, the pre-orders will start May 12th and will go through the 19th for you to pre-order the kits. Um, the kit price total will be $127.99. Um, that includes a cloth body. Um, of course the head, the arms, the legs, <laughs> and the tummy plate um, for the blanket. Now, and shipping will be free in the, in the U.S. Definitely, like I always say, it's always best if you order directly through Claire Teller. She, as she is the sculptor of this doll. So it's, you know, really beneficial if, you know, the sculptors can make as much money as they can off of their, their sculpts. And then if you cannot, you know, order directly from her or you prefer to, you know, you're out, you're overseas and you prefer to use an overseas dealer, then, you know, definitely look to your local dealer and order the uh, scope. I can assure you that these babies are very dainty and they're very cuddly once you put them together. Well, if you weight them nicely and stuff. Um, so... With that being said, I'm going to get her dressed, but I did want to give that information. Um, you can go to Claire Teller's website. It is um, ClaireTellerDolls.com. So um, I will have the links in the description bar to the page where you can go so that you know where to go to pre-order. Um, this will be an open edition, but for a limited time. So... I will let her explain all that hopefully you know she will do a separate video but from my understanding is that um, she will it is an open edition but for a limited time the pre-orders will dictate of course um, how many kits will be ordered because apparently she's gonna order only what is pre-ordered and then if there's an interest in the kits I guess more of an interest in the kits then she will decide if she wants to order more of the kits, you know, and, you know, restock. But so that's, that's why I say it's very important to still order through pre-order. That way you're guaranteed to have one. And I always, if I'm on the fence with a kit and I'm not sure that it's going to be like an ongoing running kit, I always just go ahead and order it because I know that if I don't, <laughs> I know that if I don't want it, I can either paint it and sell it or I could just sell the kit. I um actually did that with another kit. I ordered multiples of it. I kept one and sold the other. So that's just my advice. Um again, like I said, it's it's really nice when you order directly through the sculptors. And I and I I actually too I feel like we need to as a community, we need to um support a lot of the real sculptors you know all of the real sculptors and you know so buy directly from them so they can keep producing kits for us because right now sculptors are really having a crazy time with all that's going on with people trying to copy their kits and stuff like that you know um you know like the bootlegs we've seen all these crazy websites where people are you know, not selling us a real thing. And then people getting the kids, they're like, oh, this don't look like the picture because they went to, you know, 
one of these knockoff sites. So make sure if you don't, even if you don't buy directly through Clarinetella that you are going to a reputable, legit um, supplier, reborn supplier. All right, with that being said, let me take her binky out. She does have a little tongue and she does have a little bit of gums inside her mouth. <laughs> Oh, she's so cute. I might just have to change. Should I just change her later? I want to take her picture. <laughs> but, yeah, let's see. We'll, we'll go ahead and see if we get her dressed. So, I was thinking of putting her on this diaper. And this shirt. And these little pants. So, let's see what she looks like. This baby also, um, another thing is... Um, some people were asking me, are my prototypes are available? Um, this particular, pro Abby is already sold. Um, so she does have a new mommy and she will be going out, um, shortly. Um, she will be, will be being shipped, um, shortly after pre-orders. But also that allows me to get all her little special things in and um what else was i gonna tell you oh yeah so she's already sold however the other prototype artist which is sylvia and i know i'm gonna butcher your last name and i'm sorry but sylvia esquire she does have an abbey her abbey is available which i thought was beautiful too um of course they all had their different looks but definitely i think you um you would still get a beautiful baby that's already completed and it's always fun when you have them you know have the first prototypes and stuff like that but yeah abby um by sylvia is available so you can go you can find her on instagram and you can find her on facebook um she's sylvia creations um i do not pronounce that <laughs> so yeah if you want to um check her out that's fine. That's great. And I'll see if I can link her um, her page as well in the comment section, just in case, I mean, in the description section, just in case you guys are interested in purchasing her uh, prototype. Last I checked, it was still available. Now, don't quote me because I didn't check right before I did this video, but last I checked, it was available. Um, so... Yeah, so that's that's that. So both Abby and Aspen are going on pre-orders, but I wanted to do their videos separate so people wouldn't be confused. These sculpts do, these particular kits do share the same limbs. However, their faces was not sculpted to be twins. So they have their own different unique looks. And so, yeah. And of course, definitely, as you can see, if you go to Claire Teller's website, the babies can definitely look so different depending on how they're painted. Um, Claire Teller painted a dark skin Abby um, herself, which will not be um, available for sale. It's her personal Abby. And, um, but you can also be able to see what a dark skin um, or deeper chocolate, as you guys may say, um, black baby, African-American baby. <laughs> I just know what to call it these days. Um, uh, baby will look like so different versions and it just yeah so you'll be able to see but anyway I I hope that you enjoyed this video I've decided that because I want to take her a few photos before I take her out of this I'm going to come back and do a changing video and get her dressed with you guys if you guys don't mind um, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up don't forget to comment and don't forget to mark the date march 12th through march i'm sorry oh gosh not march may 12th through may 19th that um to get the pre-orders may 12th through may 19th and also guys stay tuned for more about the kids later don't forget share like comment bye